Y'all know I can't stay with the same hair all the time. New hairdo boo. You a bad girl and your friends bad too. You got the swag, so she do it. You a bad girl and your friends bad too. You got the swag, so she do Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, today I thought I'd basically just do a mini tutorial slash review on this hair that I'm currently wearing. The Free Trust Braid Wand Curl, the Ringlet Wand Curl. Um, this is a hair that I've always wanted to use for a while because I don't know if you've seen my previous video, actually my first video I made, um, it was the Jamaican Bounce Curl, uh, by, at least by Free Trust also. Um, honestly, I like this hair so much more than the bounce curl because these curls, as you can see, are more loose compared to the Jamaican bounce curl. Definitely just check out my um, my old video, the first video, if you want to see how that hairstyle looks. But these curls are like more more dropped basically compared to the um, the Jamaican bounce curl. I use the hair and the color four, yeah. Cause I'm not sure exactly how my new job works with colored hair because you know I love my blondes, my reds. So I decided to keep a little neutral, you know, in corporate right now. But we'll see how maybe maybe they might be accepting of my red hair once I get done to that also. <laughs> I use two and not two and a half, one and a half packs, almost two packs of hair. The hair comes basically um, in a package just like this. Let me show you one of the curls actually. And this is what the curl looks like. All right, but you know what? I'm gonna turn my blue scoop off on that part. I just don't want to work. Can't listen to music and do my hair at the same time because motherfucker don't want to work. First, used to install the Jamaican bounce curl. I thought it was more wandish curl, but it was more like. I, felt, I kind of felt like a little bozo-ish a little bit. I don't know if, if y'all feel like that also, but I was a little big head and it was just, it was a little too much for me. I, I wasn't really feeling that one. Even though I liked it maybe like after a week, two weeks of installation, but when I first got it done, I didn't like this. This right here is on day three hair. Um, so like, like I said, you know, the curls are so, so nice. And you know, it looks like your natural hair, basically. It looks like some wine curls that you basically just put in your head, girl and whatnot but as I stated this is what the curl looks like um, I also you know probably have snippets of video of me installing the hair if you want to see like a detailed tutorial of um, you know my crochet looks definitely check out the Jamaican bounce curl because it's basically the same exact installation how I installed this hair um, usually for the back of the hair I would just split the hair one time um, you know, definitely you don't want these frizzy pieces like this. If you do, that's perfectly fine. But for me, I'm not into the frizziness like that. Um, so you have like a piece of hair, just twirl it back around your finger. And that basically takes away a lot of that frizziness from when you first split the hair. Oh, this hair got shedding. We'll talk about that also. So that's what the curl looks like. One is twirl back around my finger. That's what the curl doesn't look like when it's not twirled on my finger. So, you know, it's definitely up to you if you want to twirl it around your finger after you get done splitting it. Um, like I said, for the back of my hair, I split it two times. Some of the front pieces, I just split three times just to, you know, make it look neat and as natural as possible. Um, kind of honestly feeling this color number two. Like I said, it just looks pretty natural. I didn't do anything to my edges. Well, not right now. I just got that from the gym. But usually, you know, you can gel your edges down. But most likely, I probably won't because girl, we natural. It looks natural. And mine is not how the edges flourish just like that the way it is. My hair was just done in straight backs. Previously, before I actually installed this hair, I actually had um, the free trust deep twist on my head because I was actually on vacation in Cancun. But you know, I was swimming in salt water, <laughs> swimming in the snow taze, all that. And my hair got pretty tangled and I was just tired of wearing it. I wanted to go back to short hair. So uh, I basically had the free trust in for about two and a half weeks. Definitely check out my other video if you want to see how I installed that hair. And then basically I just took my braids out, installed this new crochet on just some old braids. And you know, right now you can tell it's flourishing and it is popping girl, severely popping. 
as far as shedding goes there is some shedding you know just like any other crochet braids you're going to get your shedding and everything so um once i got done you know styling the hair as you can see right now i got a lot of sh i want to say it's a lot of shedding it's about minimum shedding uh, with like any other crochet hair basically maybe because i only looped the hair twice that could be the reason why but um you know there is definitely some shedding with the hair it's nothing that i would say that is too unbearable because like I said, I've been in style hair for so long. I'm used to shedding. I'm used to, you know, strands coming out. It's perfectly fine. But, you know, you're definitely going to have a little bit of shedding with this. I feel like with this hair, um, you know, the more older it gets, even the more natural it's going to even look right, you know, weeks down the line. I haven't had any problems with itching with this hair. Um, usually, if I do get itching or, if you know, if I want to spray my hair, I just use some braid. She's sheen spray, argan oil. Um, I spray this on my scalp and on the hair as well. It's good for human and synthetic hair. Um, and it also, you know, helps with shine. It, you know, soothes dry scalp, relieves itching. And honestly, this stuff really does work on my head. So this is what I usually would like, you know, spray on my braids between my hair. So, um, you know, I would just split the hair as so. Just take my bottle and just spray on the scalp like that and just rub it in. I can't see it. Child, that feels so good every time I do that. <laughs> but, um, yeah, that's something that I definitely... Ooh, okay. Okay, ooh, we definitely got it. Oh, you know, like the edges like that. <laughs> but that's definitely something um, I would recommend. Oh, you could definitely part your hair any way that you want to. Uh, I'm kind of feeling this middle part right now. You know, you can part it for a little side. You know, if you want a little side curl like that, girl. Okay, that's kind of cute. Or if you want a deep side part, you can put it like that if you want. Okay. Okay. <laughs> but, um, yeah, like I said, I'm feeling the middle part. Um, let me know what you think of this hair or if you, if you even tried this hair before. I definitely like this hair a lot more than Jamaican Bounce Curl. Let me know what hair is your favorite. Do you prefer the Ringlet Wand Curl or do you prefer the Jamaican Bounce Curl? Because I definitely want to know opinions of like what's your preference for each crochet hair. All right, guys. So that's basically about it. Like I said, which is a quick little mini review, mini tutorial of the, oh God, what's it called again? The Ringlet Wine Curl. Make sure you like my channel, subscribe to my channel. I have some vlogs coming up soon. You know, my old vlog of Coachella that I never did upload along with my Cancun. <laughs> So if there's something you want to see, definitely let me know. You know, I'm definitely trying to have this channel cater to almost anybody, all the easy, you know, crochet braiders to my uh, plus size um, tall girls over, you know, over 5'10", because I'm 6'2", you know. But let me know what you think of this hair. Let me know what you want to see, what you don't want to see, what you like, what you don't like. I'm here for the opinions. I'm here to hear whatever you want to hear, girl. Just, just let me know. We're in this together, okay? But like I said, like my channel, subscribe to my channel. I'll see y'all soon in my next video and bye.